to get out Hersman Siax Castle. Huh? That's what it says. That's my Siax. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. Oh, that looks cool. Yeah, nice. Not seen that before. Wow, look, look at that. that. Wow. Oh, wow, that looks quite cool, actually. That's a car park. Quite a nice car, so Yeah. Look at that. Wow. Smile. Smile. What's up guys, happy you doing? We're having a freaking good day as always. So in today's video, just doing a little short one here at Hurstman Zoo Castle. Or as I say, Hurstman Siax. <laughs> Unfortunately, we can't go inside the actual castle. They've rented it out to like a Canada or something to do some like English school work or something. We can have a butcher's around like a, the courtyard and everything in the garden. So yeah, let's have a butcher's anyway. It looks freaking awesome. First time I've ever been here as well. So yeah, looking pretty freaking wicked. Check this out, I'll get my ugly face out of the way. Yeah, look at that. Awesome. That's that little wicked with like the motor going around. Nice sunny day as well, which uh, makes everything look better. But lovely with the uh, moat and everything, doesn't it? Yeah, all the water around there looks awesome. So it doesn't look like a very old castle. Don't know too much about it yet. This stunning 15th century moated castle is the centerpiece of a 600 acre estate that features woodland, trails, lakes and meadows. There you go then, 15th century is a bit older than I, I thought it was. Mm. Just done a few photos around here. Yeah. Mum's probably taking pictures up her nose again as always. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, there's yeah. well, the entrance, it looks kind of cool. Nice uh, wooden door. Oh, we've got the old uh, the slits up in the wall like this. I think this is where they used to shoot like um the arrows out with the bow and arrows. I think well, I could be wrong. Probably am wrong. Maybe Mung? I'm not sure. What's inside? Yeah, it's the glass. Yeah, so that's why they shoot bow and arrows out. So um, it can shoot out and it's difficult to get in. Oh yeah, there you go. That's why I wonder whether it's been adapted a bit What's later this? on because they've got the windows. Mm, I'm not sure what that is for. Oh, it's probably to do with the... Yeah, drawbridge or something. There you go. It's inside. Yeah, it's nice, isn't it? Quite big. That's someone coming behind us now. So. Oh wow, check out the garden. That looks awesome. Yeah, well, that looks nice. Wicked. Wow, so the inside the courtyard, inside the castle, it's done like a square. This is the inside bit, obviously. Looks pretty freaking nice. Nice lot of trees. Wicked with the blue sky, man. Awesome. Okay, I'm gonna get a few, uh, few pictures now. Mm, check it out. The old uh, knight in armor. That's oh. fake armor. Yeah. <laughs> Owners of the manor of Hurstman Zoo, 1066, Edma Priest. Edma, a priest. There you go then. This is uh, the people that owned owned it. Oh, there you go. Nowadays, Perns by Queen's University, Ontario, Canada. Mm, can't believe they sold it to Canadians here in England. I hear some history as well. You can pause the screen now and read it if you wish. And here we go, as we come out the back side of the, the castle, that sounds rather funny. <laughs> as we come out the back side of the castle, we've got some more gardens, check it out. Oh wow, absolutely lovely. That's, I'm surprised there's no sort of moaty bit down here. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, it looks like they're going to change for autumn. Oh yeah, nice, check it out, they've got like a mazy bit down here, nice to uh, see. Oh, some nice flowers down here still, during the time of year. Oh, look at those purple ones. Uh, yeah, there's no water down this bit, but there's a bit of moat around the other side. I just yeah, yeah, you can see through there. So yeah, it's pretty nice in here, especially if you like uh, like gardens and everything and uh, castles. It's not the most like oldest -y castle castle, but it's still really nice to have a walk around in there. And it's uh, eight pound to come in, so not super badly priced. And yeah, it's very nice and chilled out. So obviously, you wouldn't want to spend ages in here, but um, yeah, it's cheaper than some of the other places. Check out all of these uh, flowers. I think wicked. Uh, really nice to go for a walk, especially if you've had a few more carbohydrates and a nice day as well. Get your vitamin D in, very important to get your vitamin D in. Um, just about to fall down here in the moonlit, so uh, yeah, see you after I've uh, had my accident. <laughs> Here's this uh, rusty door through here, but lovely view from outside. Check out that. Oh, yeah, awesome. Ah, oh, yeah, check out some of these flowers, they're so nice. Was it salvia patterns? Salvia patterns, look at them, they look lovely in the sun. Look at that, nice. They look cool. These red ones are nice, red flowers. There's no sign, so I don't know uh, what they are. I'm not a flower expert. These ones are lovely though, lovely colour purple. Look at those. Awesome. Oh, look, these are nice. 
Oh, they are lovely. Ooh, I'll try and get that on slow mo if I can. That's gone. Look at that, lovely flowers. Like I say we're in uh, the beginning of October here, or coming up to mid October, so uh, they're not all uh, in their full uh, glory, but still absolutely lovely. Some lovely flowers still. Look at that, really nice. It's very autumn y and whatnot. Beautiful. What do you think then? It's good, it's nice. It's good, it's nice. Mm -hmm. You like it, Mama? Yeah, so I think a few weeks earlier, you got more benefit from the flowers. Yeah, definitely. I'll say some of them are dying off, but still some nice ones around. You should get some like these in your garden. Oh, yeah, they look awesome, don't they? Yeah, I was, I was thinking that. The actual colour looks all, right, all nice already. It's a bit like a coconut and durian mixed together. <laughs> we just come out like the dorm out of the, the grounds. We're just past the moat now. Check it out, there's a few duckies there in the background. There they are, quacking away. Awesome. Smile! <laughs> What's mother doing? <laughs> After our little trip down here, we just come out to the other side. There's a, a maze apparently, welcome to Marlow Maze. Can you find the exit? No cheating, stick to the pass. Please do not hang on the ropes and have an amazing time. There we go. I'll tell you what, I am definitely having an amazing time. Whoa! Can I find the exit though? Can't find the exit, Bring it out, getting lost. As you can see, it's very big and difficult. <laughs> Oh look, there's a house, like a little house in the country. Oh, we live in a house, a very big house in the country. It's not that big. He lives in a house, a very small house in the country. <laughs> and I've just made it out of the exit, amazing. And it only took me about a minute and 30 seconds. Even in my massive, obese, unfit state, I managed to get out of it. Mum's lost, she can't get out, she's gonna be stuck in there forever, as you can see. <laughs> Oh dear, oh, God, lovely day, all oh, those trees. It's just coming into autumn, it's just like so nice. Check it out. Cheat, cheat, cheat. I thought I'd done it. I thought I'd done it. Cheat, oh, terrible, Mum. Terrible. <laughs> Come out of the maze and walk into this uh, old uh, house in the country. This looks like an absolutely amazing place to have, like a horror film. How cool would that be? Yeah, it's definitely a horror film. The house in the country. Everyone comes to view, nobody leaves. <laughs> so I'm thinking, dead house, country house, no, murder at the country house. So it's a small house in the country, but a lot of bodies in the garden. That's crap. I can't think of anything at the moment, but uh, yeah. Anyway, if you can think of a decent name for a horror film for this house, let me know in the comments. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, so friggin' annoying they're doing all these bloody cuttings, I tell you. So just look in the background. Be so peaceful otherwise. Such a lovely day. I like, say, oh, get your vitamin D. So important for your health. Uh, and not being fat as hell is uh, very important as well. I'm so friggin' obese and horrible at the moment. It's horrible. Absolutely disgusting. But uh, yeah, back to my diet soon in a few days when I head back off to Thailand. So uh, stay tuned for my weight loss video. If all goes pl to plan and I don't have any more health problems, I uh, should be losing the weight pretty quickly before Christmas. Even though uh, slow and steady wins the race, but uh, yeah. Ooh. Oh man, lovely. Oh bloody hell, we fell down the rabbit hole. <laughs> yeah, you gotta be careful when you're in like the country, like in England, there's like little holes. Like, oh, rabbit holes, obviously. You put your foot in there, you go absolutely freaking flying. I've already uh, smashed my ligaments in my ankle, so uh, don't need to do the other one. Finally got to the haunted house. You see all of these uh, moulds of uh, mud down here, that's where they uh, obviously dug up and buried the bodies. Ah, it's a lot smaller when you get close to it, it's crazy. Yeah, that's quite creepy. Oh, there's a nice little walk up here as well. Oh my god, I'm so out of breath. I'm so unhealthy at the moment, it's horrible. Oh, there's a nice little verandry bit up there. View over the moat and everything, wicked. Don't know what's inside, it looks like a derelict now. What's it say? The... The Rolly, the Folly, the Folly. Sounds a bit kinky, I don't know why. Please help us keep the rabbits out by closing the door behind you. Oh wow, 
Oh, you can open it, can you? Oh, wow. Shit. Oh, my God. You can come into this house. <laughs> Wicked. I didn't know that. Oh, shit. Shut the door. I do have a bit of a DIY down here. And here you are then, check it out. Nice little garden in the back. Wicked. Oh, nice. Does it go up there? Probably not, you can, but barred off. Nice little garden, check it out. There's a cool little house, that. Yeah, not sure we can go up the other side. Do not enter. Or no entry, even. Same, same. Same, same, but different. Why can't you go up here? That's annoying. Can I go up here or not? Maybe not. Can I go up a little bit? I don't know. Maybe. Is there any cameras? Not supposed to go up here. No entry. Just want to have a quick bushes. Oh yeah, wicked. Check out that. Ooh. The view of the garden up here. Probably get told off in a minute. There's the garden anyway. Check it out. Lovely. That's a cool little place. Nice. Oh shit. About to get told off. About to get told off. Just uh, I managed to survive the haunted house. Um, yeah. And uh, just come up this uh, lovely bit up here. And look, we've got these lovely Aces. My well, mum says they're Aces. Not the same as my laptop, which is an Acer Predator. Uh, yeah, lovely bit of gardens. Nice big trees. Just like I say, just found that like, oak trees, which are awesome. Uh, nice tree. Same we're not standing here a little bit longer, so the autumn. Autumn leaves have changed more, but uh, it's all good. <laughs> Check it out, got acorns. Oh, awesome. Oh, oak tree. Wicked. From, uh, if you remember these from, uh, what's the sound? what's the film? What's Far and not Far uh, Ice Age. Oh, Ice Age. Yeah, a little squirrel tries to catch her, doesn't he? Squirrel thing in my bobby. <laughs> you found something? Yeah, I never knew that they had... Oh, what's that? Seeds, this must be seeds, Oh, it? wow, yeah, it must be. Look at that thing, that looks weird. It's quite hard. It's quite hard. There's a dried one here. Oh, is that? Mm. Try that. We might plant it and see. I was pinching all the seeds from this garden. <laughs> see if she can uh, grow them. Oh, there you go. Thank you. I think it has to be round here somewhere. I think with the bigger trees. Like yeah. Oh, wicked. Show that old bit of tree out. That is wicked. Awesome. Nice. Oh, it's a lovely walk round here. Oh, Conker. Oh, wow. An undeveloped one, but oh, wow, chestnut look at that. Horse chestnut cheese, apparently. Horse chestnut tree. This is how they grow cheese. Conker. A what? An underdeveloped conker. Underdeveloped conker. Wicked. Oh, check out. So we just come out the walky area and the lovely view of the castle over here. Shame about that bloody building noise. So annoying. Oh, look at that though. That's wicked. Oh, lovely fresh air. A bit of smell of fresh grass as well is always nice. Nice place to walk your dogs as well if you've got a dog. Check it out. Freaking awesome conker tree. Wicked. Oh, wow. It's love playing conkers. Absolutely loads on there at the moment. Look at that. Can you see them all? Nice. I'll see if there's any on the ground. Very different to the one at Ulfriston. So, look at how small these ones are. Check out my Ulfriston video if you haven't already, by the way. Yeah, very tiny. They're very small, look. Awesome ones up on here, though. Be careful, they're quite sharp on here, a bit spiky. Uh, probably coming in a few weeks, maybe. This, this tree's got loads of acorns, much bigger ones on this one. Oh, wicked, there's loads on the floor. Look at them all! Wow, look at all the acorns! Yeah, tons of them on the floor here. Yeah, so, so loads of big ones here. Look, yeah, they're all, all coming off now. Just come out this uh, little area here. We've got a nice little, like a I don't know, gazebo y sort of typey area. Nice little garden. Awesome. It's cool, isn't it? So look at it inside. There's the view of the uh, the old castle as you walk through. Yeah, some nice seats to chill. And then, uh, yeah, look at that. Shame uh, the sun's in the position as it is. It's a bit dull and... Well, uh, check out these. These plants are awesome. Flowers, plants, whatever they're called. Look at them. Oh, <laughs> wicked. It's up blowing wind. Oh man, they're well nice. You know, frog lady uh, reading a book. 
<laughs> Santa, uh, Santa, uh, sundial. So, guess what the time is? Yeah, who it is, guy, the most famous guy, John Flamsteed. If you don't know who he is, he's a guy that has to do with flames and steeds. Interesting, these yeah, things, I like they? them. Yeah, I, don't know what they are. I suppose I could use that seat thing. Should I look at that? See what they are. Oh. Some sort of plummy thing, I think. Very soft, maybe it's just a uh, no, probably a seed pod. Look at these, these are awesome. It's like blowing wind. Look at that, lovely. Whoa, check it out, trap door. <laughs> Trap door, trap door. Wicked. Oh, there we go, lovely castle. What's that? Yeah. Eventually being shortened to Hearst and Sue, and Hearst is Saxon in, a, in origin mm. and means a clearing in the wood. Oh, what does Sue mean, did you say? Say about the Sue part. Oh. So. That's the bit that sounds French. <laughs> so, whether that part. Yeah. Yeah, so 11, 1180. Mm, quite old. So, you get out a couple of fish now, and the moment. Awesome. They're not bad size, they are. Good size. Oh, there's a, a couple here as well coming. Come outside the castle now. Got cool trees. Awesome trees. There's mum trying to find a new house inside. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. That's wicked, isn't it? That's cool. Come up inside. And, uh, wow, look at that. Awesome, or what? Yeah. Yeah. So it looks lovely, the garden outside uh, the drawbridge. Whatever you call it. And yeah, look at these trees, they're wicked. Look how nice they look. Oh, I love weird looking trees. That's so cool. So I'm going to cut that one down. Uh, this one up here is still going strong. Must be bloody old, I tell you. Look at the age of them. Must be so old, they're so big. So, so big. There you go, check it out. That's chestnut. It's not a chestnut. It's not a chestnut, that's what I keep telling you. It's not a chestnut, it's a conker. So you come outside this part of the castle, they've got a nice sort of like tea room and whatnot outside. Lovely, cool, look at that. Uh, got one of the traditional uh, post boxes, post boxes as well. Oh, there we go, back in the good old days, telephone boxes. <laughs> oh wow, check it out, we've got a, um, what are they called, what are they called, I can't remember. Can't remember the background there. Can you move to a nicer looking background, please, Mr. A oh, peacock, there you go. Oh. Get that. Going into the gardens. Enjoy the view, Mr. Peacock. Oh, there's a couple of peacocks around here. Yeah, so check it out. They've got some awesome peacocks here. Just chilling in the garden, eating all the flowers. <laughs> Get out guys, you can see that peacock's in the garden. Awesome. They're such cool birds, I love these. They look so nice. Try and get a closer look without scaring them. Okay, there we go then guys, that was our little trip at Hurstman Zoo Castle, hope you enjoyed that little short video. Uh, yeah, check it out if you're here in uh, East Sussex, a really cool place to have a walk around, and like I say, lovely to get a bit of fresh air and your vitamin D. Anyway, thanks for watching, take care, stay cool, follow me on Instagram and Twitter, check out some of my other travel vlogs, keto uh, recipes, cooking, food and all that malarkey, and I'll see you on the next video. Take care and stay cool. Chicka pow 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 pow. Chicka pow 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 pow.
Ciao. 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 Ciao.